Thank you. You're welcome. Come on, baby. I get it. Thank you. Let me get her on the other side. So this chunky mud puppy is Gracie, and Gracie is our next mare due to have a baby. But she's kind of filthy, so she needs a bath. So let's go do a checkup and a little bathing session on this piggy. <laughs> it has been way too cold and way too disgusting to give her a full on bath. So we're taking advantage of this weird 65 degree day to go ahead and get her all clean, even though she's probably gonna go roll around and get filthy tomorrow. Sweet girl. All right, Mama Trudy is not happy that I just walked by her with another mare, but this is our stop. Good girl. I don't have the most organized wash bay or brand new stuff. Just kind of have what works. And uh, I don't have like a really awesome long bathing routine. We're just gonna slap some shampoo and conditioner on her and get her tangles out and call it a day. Hey, can I sneak a peek at your baby? Maybe we'll bathe you here in a little bit. She's finally nice to me again. You were very mean for a couple of days. Look at their new baby. Penelope. Mama's like, no. Are you biting mama's legs? <laughs> what are you doing, girl? All right, let's get let's get to Miss Gracie. It's probably dangerous setting my phone there, but we're gonna go ahead and just get her wet. Now we do have heated water in here, so that's nice. This is gonna feel so good, Gracie. Now, she's my only gray horse. I used to show a gray, gray horse, so I had all these tricks as to how to get him so white looking, and I don't really do those anymore, and we're just kinda getting her clean and not gonna make her stand here longer than she has to. So her tail is not gonna be pristinely white by the end of this, I'm just warning ya. You gotta find that like perfect middle. We'll start out by just getting her wet all over. Let me get my little TikTok blurbs. Let's get you wet all over, Gracie. I can't remember if you like your face or not. Some horses are okay with you, you know, putting water in their face. You just have to make sure you don't get it in their ears. Others hate it. I can't, she doesn't get a whole lot of like, you know, baths for no reason. So I can't remember. She is so wide that water just like sits in the middle of her. Got your face all dirty, girl. You look like a different woman. Oh, my phone got so wet. It's not good. I guess we could use some purple shampoo on you. Yeah, we got some white bright. Woo! It's like purple shampoo for blonde girls. Gracie's about to have no brass. Purple shampoo's gonna have her so bright. This belly is so deep. That's the thing about graves who are almost white. You can't like skimp over areas because it tells where you missed. Can I get your face just a little bit? You're such a sweet girl.
Look at all that dirt coming off. Might have to do two washes. That's a lot of purple. Want some? That's also why I don't wear my normal wedding ring to the barn. This is my, uh, K this is a shameless plug. This is my KVS ring from Groove Life. I have six rings in my collection and uh, this is the quiver ring. <laughs> Back to normal broadcasting after that ad. Look how much whiter. Now my hands are too wet to use my phone. I'm juggling. I'm making a TikTok and a YouTube video all at the same time. I probably should have just chose one, shouldn't I? <laughs> We're going to use the um, super exclusive $1 conditioner from Swap that someone has put water in to make it stretch longer because $1 is not cheap enough. <laughs> All right, I hope you don't mind, Gracie. I'm just gonna use your butt really fast. <laughs> oh, you are such a chunk. You, I can use your butt as a shelf. Here we go. Let's get this conditioner on your mane, girl. She doesn't have like super thick, luscious mane, but we still want it to look pretty. Is there makeup running down my face? Cause she got me. Like there is probably stuff all over my face. People are probably cringing at me breaking this hair right now. I don't care. Like there's so many people that like get mad at me on TikTok and stuff when I don't do things the way they do them. And I'm like, she's a broodmare. Like, yes, I want her to have pretty mane, but like it doesn't really matter. I'm, I'm sorry that I'm talking about you that way. You are like way more than just a broodmare, Gracie. Well, I'm gonna try to have everything that I used, like the detangler and the shampoo linked in my Amazon storefront. I'll have that linked below so that you can go find it easily. Cause I know sometimes it's overwhelming going to like a tax shop. So if you wanna just go order it online, I'll have that all linked in a like horse bathing category. Now this is mine and I think everyone's favorite part of bathing, which is scraping the water off. So that's really fun. There's some show sheen. So I'll scrape her off first. It helps them dry quicker. Um, it, when it's cooling down like this, it doesn't make them stay wet as long, you know, so she doesn't get cold. And then this is just Shoshin. We just buy big jugs of it and put it in other bottles. So this is just like a shine kind of deal. It doesn't do anything other than make her coat slick and nice looking. Here we go. Then it would look all slick and pretty. This was more of a make her feel better rather than for looks type of bathing. So let's uh, go let her dry in her stall and maybe uh, I can take some pictures afterwards if she doesn't roll because I feel like you're gonna roll and make all this go away and you're just gonna be filthy all over again. So Gracie's at 318 days pregnant today. We checked on her a week ago. So I don't think we actually got to look at her udder and whatnot in that update because it was chaotic and she wouldn't let us look at her. She was running around. So if you want to come in here and we'll look at her udder as um, 
what it looks like today. She's a maiden mare, so it's not gonna be too big, but she has made a lot of progress from where she was even a week ago. Um, you see a, a lot of like the milk production right in this area, some edema. We're not worried about that as long as she still has a small udder. And then another change that she has made is her tail and her hip softening. So when we first did, like I think episode number one of the broodmare checks, she wouldn't let me bring her tail up over this. And she's actually being like a little bit of a turd right now. Every night she's let me bring it up farther and farther. So look how loose that is now. So she's getting ready to be able to like lift that up for the baby to come out. And she's also a lot softer in this region. And I noticed, cause she usually has this big round quarter horse butt, which she still does, but I'm seeing a lot of sinking in this area, which happens as they get closer to foaling. So that is our update on Gracie. That belly is looking low. We're excited for that baby. I hope that made you feel better and got all those itches done. If you enjoyed that, please let me know. If you haven't already, like, subscribe, leave me a comment. It helps me out a lot and stay tuned because I don't think Gracie's gonna wait too long to have that baby.